Have you heard the name Park Jinju? If not, I'm sure you've seen her face at least once somewhere, because this stunning actress has appeared in nearly 50 TV series and movies throughout her 11-year career. Hello guys, K-Drama for Life's here. In this video, let's look into her incredible life and how talented Park Jinju is. Park Jinju is a South Korean actress under Anne Mark Entertainment. Born on December 24, 1988, she majored in musicals in university while also working as a vocal trainer before becoming an actor. Actress Park Jinju had a successful debut, and it was here that she left a strong impression on the audience. She played a unique character in the movie Sunny, which was released in 2011. In the early days of her career, she mainly played cheerful youth-oriented characters in movies, Koala 2013, which deals with the startup stories of young people, and My Sister, The Pig Lady 2015, which depicts the story of young women are examples. Park Jinju's charm is her ability to nail any role in both movies and dramas, making her one of the most versatile and beloved supporting actors in the industry. The signature style of her acting is the bright tone of a young woman who lives happily in her life without losing dreams and hopes. On the other hand, she is known to act in an extremely different tone, and in the horror The Sleepless 2012, she played the role of a high school girl in horror, making sure the audience felt her fear. This different look further cemented herself as a talented actress. In the trendy UTV series she often worked in, Park Jin Ju usually appeared as a supporting actor who brought fun to the drama. While building up her own style with her clear diction, skillful dialect acting, and very experienced acting style for her age, Park tries to change her image little by little. Default 2018 is a case in point. In the movie, which deals with Korean society, which was chaotic during the IMF bailout, Park Jin Ju appeared as a member of a financial team that tries to save the nation from financial disaster, showing a cold and cool performance without any laughter. She is also known for her hilarious ability to give great nasty comments on screen, but still deliver them in a funny way. She slowly gained recognition in TV series and won the Best Supporting Actress at the SBS Entertainment Awards for Reunited Worlds 2017. In the movie Swing Kids 2018, she worked with Kang Hyung Chul again, the director of Sunny 2011, showing off her unique character acting once again. Park Jin Ju is not only good at acting, but also has a good character and makes the people around her happy simply by being present. People describe her as an actress I want to work with. This is possible because Park Jin Ju never forgets to be grateful and humble. When asked about, you have been active as an actress for many years now, what made you fall in love with acting? Park Jin Ju answered, In my early years, I didn't have a clear dream. However, as I grew up, I felt the most agitation in my heart and I enjoyed the charm of acting that could move people's hearts. As I followed that path, I became an actor and I think I'm continuing to do this job to the extent that I cannot think of anything else. Not only that, her talent in singing even had producer Kim Hyun Chol questioning, why didn't you become a singer? You should have been a singer. I never imagined that I would be able to perform in front of many people through singing. In fact, rather than planning something, I think this precious opportunity occurred as things naturally flowed. A lot of people like the way I sing, so if given the opportunity, I want to show more diverse sides of myself," Park Jin Ju explained. If you want to know how amazing the actress's voice is, listen to her excellent singing skills in the entertainment show King of Mass Singer and Cherry Filter's Flying Duck at the 2018 DMC Festival and be amazed. As of 2022, Jin Ju has been promoted as a member of MBC's project girl group, WSG Wannabe. Her private life is a romantic comedy about a talented gallery curator named Sung Duk Mi, who is an idol fangirl underneath her professional veneer. Meanwhile, her boss Ryan becomes a passionate fanboy of hers. The main leads of TVN's Wednesday to Thursday drama Her Private Life truly shine, but at the same time, Park Jin Ju has been stealing the show with her charming persona. In the drama, Park Jin Ju plays Lee Sun Ju, Sung Duk Mi's, played by Park Min Young, fellow fangirl that makes all the viewers want a best friend like her. Giving love advice and sharing a similar hobby of fangirling, Lee Sun Ju and her friendship with Sung Duk Mi were realistically portrayed by the talented actress, stating the words, the person you must meet in your life is not your soulmate, but your fangirl soulmate. And when reality sucks, fangirl. Lee Son Ju is a relatable character with irresistible charms and perfectly timed comments that are beyond refreshing. Another incredible series she was part of was It's Okay to Not Be Okay, a story that follows Moon Gang Tae, an orphan and caregiver who lives with his brother, Moon Sung Tae, who has autism. 
After Gang Tae starts to work at OK Psychiatric Hospital, he crosses paths with a famous antisocial writer named Ko Moon Young. However, when she discovers that their pasts have overlapped, she begins to develop romantic feelings for Gang Tae. Throughout the show, as they bond, they work through their issues and help each other heal emotionally. Without a doubt, It's Okay Not to Be Okay is at its best when portraying mental illnesses, healing, and the bonds between brothers. In June 2020, after it was broadcast, It's Okay to Not Be Okay quickly became a massive hit, not only domestically, but also internationally. In addition to its new and unique storyline, the drama also features a solid cast consisting of talented actors in Korea's entertainment industry. Park Jinju plays a character known as Yu Sung Jae, an artistic director of Song and Company. Yu Sung Jae and fried chicken restaurant owner Jo Jae Su have contributed significantly to the success of the drama thanks to the humorous and equally adorable scenes. You will want to take about four minutes to listen to her cover of You Are My Everything because you will have goosebumps with this mesmerizing voice. Next up was another heart-tugging drama. SBS's Our Beloved Summer is a drama about ex-couple Choi Woong, Choi Woo Shik, and Guk Yoon Soo, Kim Da Mi, whose relationship did not end on good terms. Years later, the documentary they filmed in high school suddenly gains popularity, and they're forced to be together in front of the camera once more. In Our Beloved Summer, Park Jin Ju plays Lee Sol Yi, a former writer, current pub owner, and Guk Yoon Soo's only friend. In contrast to Guk Yoon Soo's stiff and quiet approach to navigating her relationship with Choi Woo, Lee Sol Yi watched from the side and offered refreshing and funny advice. Our Beloved Summer wouldn't be a success if it weren't for its amazing cast that perfectly portray the emotions of their respective characters. Kim Da Mi, Choi Woo Sik, Kim Song Cho, and every supporting actor in the drama made the SBS TV series an unforgettable one. Among them, it is impossible not to mention Park Jin Ju, who decorated the drama with her refreshing acting performance and charismatic visuals. Since the two actresses play such close friends in the drama, Park Jin Ju revealed that she had initially been worried about becoming close with Kim Da Mi. We're both pretty quiet. We're both really shy. I thought it was important for us to get close quickly, so I was really worried at the time of our first filming, because Kim Da Mi and I had to be really comfortable around one another to match our characters. However, there turned out to be no need for such concerns. Park Jin Ju explained, as soon as we started throwing lines back and forth, our chemistry matched so well, to the point where I felt euphoric. After three extremely successful K-dramas, Park Jin Ju continued to contribute in the series Yumi Sells 2, If You Wish Upon Me, and Desperate Mr. X released in 2022, but they all failed to attract attention in the movie market. What's next for this talented actor? On August 31st, KST, the production team of NBC's Hangout With You stated, Park Jin Ju has been confirmed to join the show as a new member. Please look forward to how she will be interacting with the existing members and send your support. Park Jin Ju has frequently appeared on variety programs, drawing a lot of laughter with her humorous personality. In addition to her great acting skills, Park Jin Ju raised in for her unique characteristics and sense of humor by joining Hang Out With You. Park said, I'm so grateful for this opportunity. I will do my utmost best not only in acting, but also provide viewers with entertainment, happiness, and laughter. Which of her roles are your favorite? Leave a comment. Thanks for watching!